Hello! Welcome to Crimson Spotlight! Ah! <laughs> what? Yes, for the first time in one full year or more, I finally decided to make another one of these videos. Why? Because I want to, bitch. <laughs> because now I have a PS4 and I can record clips instead of just using fucking images. Although I will still use images, but I will also use clips because I just I don't know how to do this without my amazing images taken by myself. Also the clips will be taken by myself. I'm a fucking wizard. Anyway, back to what really matters. Today I would like to talk about Is 8 Lacrimosa of Dana. So what does this game entail? First, let's go all the way back to what the hell is 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 it is what is is basically is is a game that chronicles the adventures of Adel Kristen. This guy, he doesn't talk much. Goddamn sound protagonist. Anyway, in this eight, Adel is voluntarily part of a ship crew that is added to who the fuck cares? The name will not be mentioned ever again throughout the game. And shit goes out. Kraken blows the ship up, and everyone dies. I'm just kidding. Adel wakes up in a random ass bitch, a uh, bitch. Uh, I said bitch, and he meets a random ass bitch. Yeah, named Luxia, who is bathing nearby. Anime trope alert. Quiz time. What will happen here? A. Luxia drops the towel and they have the sexy times. B. Luxia stabs the shit out of Adel and he dies. C. Dana drops the towel and that's the wrong character. Please ignore this answer. D. Luxia drops the towel and slaps Adel in the face. Or E. Luxia drops the towel and... Hang on a minute. Where did she get the towel? She just went through a shipwreck. You're not supposed to be writing this. Fuck it, the answer is D. Because bitches love the D. They then find Captain Barboza and Dog, Adel's adventure companion and best friend. Get it? Because his name is Doggy and it sounds like Dog. And he's Adel's best friend. Like, that, that kind of sounded funnier in my head, to be honest. Meh. After that, they start forming the Castaway Village, which the name is pretty self-explanatory. Next! Alright then, let's jump into my favorite part of these videos, the characters. Our main party consists of Adel, our mute protagonist. Noble Bitch, she knows dinosaurs and stuff. Sad Nautilus, does not float, I am disappointed. Humble Shoes! He's actually pretty cool and funny. Tan Lolly, please do not lewd. Donna, our cute protagonist that is actually Sani. And Mishi, because I'm the one making this video and if I want a Mishi on my party, I will have a Mishi on my party. And now let's go through some NPCs, including Hot Blacksmith, Casual Man, Gone Wild, Moneyless Bags, Cop Police Dude, Steel Wires for Days, no way, she's 32! Prankster Lolly! Granny, who is ripped as fuck! Thanatos! Cashew! Ease, Memories of Celseta Plot! Godbird! Persona 4 Cat Bird Edition! Not a Lolly! The Fantastic Four! Let me smash that tree! And the shit ton of other characters that I don't feel like mentioning right now. What is the battle system? Hack and slash! Next question! What do you do in this game? Good question! I don't know. The point of the game is explore Siren Island. That's where we are, by the way. Find other castaways. Build a ship. And get the fuck out of here and be shipwrecked by Kraken again. Fuck, let's, let's realize the plan. Build a ship. Find and stab the shit out of Kraken with the help of your submarine. By which I mean this random ass necklace that lets you breathe underwater without having to use Morph on a ghost ship to get the guidebook to trade for the underwater material in Calm. I wish Final Fantasy VII had this necklace. Anyway, uh, where was I? Uh, uh, revise the plan! Explore, find best lolly Ricota, find Mishi, feed Mishi, obey Mishi, 
find the UGS tree, find best girl Dana, build a ship, shit on Kraken, warning! Global warming is causing dinosaurs to show up. Actually, no, it's a thing called the Lacrimosa that's sending the world. Add save the world to the plan. World is saved. Let's get the fuck back home. I wanna go watch some anime.